Begin PPV in room air, 21% oxygen. Place a pulse oximeter sensor on the baby's right hand or wrist. After 15 seconds of PPV, do the first heart rate assessment. Your assistant should announce if the heart rate is increasing or not increasing, and if the chest is moving or not moving with ventilation. If the heart rate is increasing, continue PPV. You do not need to do ventilation corrective steps to attain chest movement if the heart rate is increasing. Continue PPV for another 15 seconds and assess the heart rate. If the heart rate is not increasing, but the chest is moving, continue PPV and assess the heart rate after another 15 seconds of PPV that moves the chest. If the heart rate is not increasing and the chest is not moving, begin Mr. Sopa ventilation corrective steps immediately. Move quickly through each Mr. Sopa step until you achieve chest movement with PPV. Then give PPV for 30 seconds. M and R, mask adjustment and head repositioning. These steps come first and often solve the problem. Adjust the mask and reposition the head. Give several breaths and assess chest movement. If the chest still does not move with PPV, perform S and O. Suction the mouth and nose and open the mouth. Again, give several breaths and assess chest movement. If the chest still does not move, do step P. Increase the pressure in increments of 5 to 10 centimeters water until you reach the maximum recommended pressure for a term newborn, which is 40 centimeters water. Attempt PPV again and assess for chest movement. If the chest still does not move, insert an alternative airway using an endotracheal tube or laryngeal mask. Ensure proper positioning of the airway and attempt PPV again. Do 30 seconds of PPV with chest movement. Discontinue PPV when the heart rate is more than 100 beats per minute and the baby is breathing.